a math lesson. As told by Ed Thompson. Teaching math in the 1950s. A logger sells a truckload of lumber for $100. His cost of production is four fifth of the price. What is his profit? Hmm. Teaching math in the 1960s. A logger sells a truckload of lumber for $100. His cost of production is four fifth of the price, or $80. What is his profit? Hmm. Teaching math in the 1970s. A logger exchanges a set L of lumber for a set M of money. The cardinality of M is 100. Each element is worth $1. Make 100 dots representing the elements of the set M. The set C, the cost of production, contains 20 fewer points than set M. Represent the set C as a subset of M and answer the following question. What is the cardinality of set P of profits? Hmm. Teaching math in the 1980s. A logger sells a truckload of lumber for $100. His cost of production is $80 and his profit is $20. Your assignment? Underline the number 20. Teaching math in the 1990s. By cutting down beautiful forest trees, the logger makes $20. What do you think of this way of making a living? How do you think the forest birds and squirrels feel? There are no wrong answers. Teaching math in 2001. Because you had a bad day, you take it one down. A logger sells a truckload of lumber for $100. His cost of production is $120. How does your accounting firm determine your profit margin is $60? The Teaching math in 2020. El aquero vende un camión de carga por 100 dólares. El costo de producción es 80 dólares. Pero ya... Yeah.